Hey everyone, it's Pixelade here and welcome back to the channel. There is a survey. It's actually, I believe, a private survey. Not every simmer is being sent this and I don't think The Sims is actually pushing this on any of their socials or on the game menu for The Sims 4. So I don't know how many of you received this or how many of you know about this or even have a link to take it. When I exit out of full screen, it actually says in the link, non buyer survey game pack 11 and my wedding stories is the 11th game pack so they're sending out a survey to select simmers but they haven't said anything publicly yet about the game and its issues i just find this so weird and i'm definitely gonna make a video we're gonna walk through this together welcome simmer please take this quick survey to share your thoughts with us information is being collected by a third party on behalf of electronic arts all right which of the following game packs have you heard of so they list all of them, including My Wedding Story. So this is definitely something that's very new if it's going to have that on there. The options are, yes, I know this pack very well. Yes, but not sure what it offers and unaware. How did you become aware of the My Wedding Stories pack? Well, just letting you guys know, I don't know if this is a private thing. I'm going to put the link to this below pinned in the comments. I think they didn't want this to be pushed out to every simmer. They probably only wanted this to go to select simmers obviously non-buyers because they know that if you bought the pack you're gonna be pretty upset with it considering that you know most of it kind of doesn't work so this is just so sketchy to me they are pushing out a survey for the new pack to non-buyers of game pack 11 non-buyers okay ea this is sketchy i don't know why they're doing this if you're gonna put out a survey put it to everyone including the people that have bought it so that we can report to you what's wrong with this pack i mean i'm sure you're well aware of what's wrong but it's like they're trying to hide from it the next page asks, what would influence your decision to purchase this pack? Nothing further. I already planned a purchase, seeing a trailer or pack gameplay, being able to try the pack before I buy it. Resolution of bugs slash crashes. <laughs> So they acknowledge the bugs and issues on the survey they're sending out to non-buyers, but they won't address the issues publicly to the people that have bought them. This is really, really rubbing me the wrong way. I feel like, okay, we have one problem. I try to just pretend like it's not an issue. I give them the benefit of the doubt. Then it's another thing. Then it's another thing. And then now this. I'm sorry. This is so sketchy. Seeing positive reviews, <laughs> the pack going on sale, a friend recommending it, playing with recent scenarios saying what other players create with the pack other and nothing i won't purchase this pack this is so interesting oh my gosh so they're well aware of the issues but they won't say anything about it but instead they're pushing out a survey to non-buyers of the pack asking them what they would need to know or see before they buy it so instead of giving transparency to those they've already collected money from their goal is to try to collect money elsewhere from those that haven't bought it because of the issues that's just what this is screaming to me i'm so sorry it really is this is just on another level of low at least from what i'm getting out of this i don't know maybe there's another agenda here but this is just wow okay which of the following scenarios have you played with okay so asking about some of the new scenarios here power couple honeymooners and engaged in conflict compared to the base game weddings what have you heard about my wedding stories pack weddings <laughs> <laughs> what have you heard? Oh, geez. Well, I mean, from all the early access game changer content, and of course, now from the public's reception of the pack, it probably hasn't been so good. They are much worse. Exactly. They are much worse. Just address them. Address the issues publicly to everyone, including the people you took money from. These people are paying for a product and haven't gotten them. And your first concern is to try to communicate and ask for feedback from those that haven't bought them. How about you talk to the people you took money from first i'm sorry but this is so ew they are much worse absolutely and what else do you want to tell us you know what i'm gonna put this link to my survey pinned in the comments below whether you bought this or not please click this link and tell them everything please be completely honest share your full truthful honest unbarred feedback with them so they are well aware i mean i'm sure they're well aware but make them well aware again i really don't know what else i want to say that's it i'm just gonna leave this here discuss below. This is just so scummy to me. 
<laughs> I mean, I'm sure they have good intentions and I'm sure it probably isn't even the Sims team doing this. It's probably EA that's probably making the Sims team post this kind of stuff. I don't know, but it just rubs me the wrong way. I love you. Thank you for watching. Take the survey and I'll see you guys next time. Happy Simming. This video was brought to you by my supporters on Patreon. Thank you guys so, so much for your support. If you'd like to join my community over there, a link is below. Thank you for watching.